I'll get this out right away. This game is terrible, and it might even be one of the worst games I've ever played. This is muscle for the Nintendo Entertainment System, and I seriously can't think of anything positive to say about this game. The game, if you can call it that, is a fighting title, albeit with some of the worst hit detection I've ever seen. You can choose your character, but all of them look pretty much the same as you go around the ring trying to hit your opponent, but the punch attack is about as useful as not pressing anything, so you'll end up relying on bouncing off the ropes at the side to attack. You can also do a jump attack, but even that's tricky to use. You've got something at the top, which I suppose is your life bar, although it doesn't seem to go up or down in any logical pattern. Now, this is a tag team game, so you can go and switch out your character to play as another who is equally hard to control. The graphics for this game are just awful. It really seems as if the game could have been played on the Atari 2600, and the audio for the game could also indicate that this game in no way needs the power of the 8-bit NES. Every now and then, a little ball comes across the ring and you can touch it and you'll start flashing different colours, although apparently this enables you to do a special move. Yeah, believe it or not, this game has special moves. Sometimes you win matches, sometimes you lose them, but in the end, you always lose when you're playing muscle. Lose out on precious life, that is. The funniest thing about this game is that you can play it with two players, because if you're going to suffer, you may as well drag somebody else along with you. So that's muscle, everybody, and there is not a single positive thing I can say about this game. It's boring, it's ugly, and it barely functions. Forget the boring and ugly parts, functionality is the minimum any game should aspire for, and I'm not sure if muscle is even functional.